Hello friends, in this video we are going to see some Quarkus life cycle method. So those methods, so we will see basically methods which are invoked at the server startup, application startup and application shutdown. Okay, we need those basically life cycle method to initialize few data at the time of startup and we need to clean up some data or gracefully clean up basically. So we need this the methods which invoked at the time of shutdown. Okay, let's start. So let's go here basically and we will generate one application. So let me copy this guy and we so we will generate the application. It will take few times. Yeah, it's done. So let's open day three. Okay, life cycle test open. Trust the project and let's open. So here in the Java there is nothing. So we will create one package. New package. Quarkus, okay. So let's create a my f, okay. So here we will give PSPM. So to make it main method class, so we have to Quarkus annotate it with Quarkus main. Okay, then this is the main method. So to start the application, Quarkus dot run, and we have to pass the ARGS arguments. Okay, okay, done. So this will start up the application. So we need a win to look at the basically life cycle methods. So let's take this name my bin. So we will annotate this edge application scope. Okay, so that will initialize. So we will just take one method is not I mean one field name just not required basically kept it so this is done so let's see what are the life cycle method okay I have so these are the four life cycle method I have okay so let's import these classes okay so this is basically observes at the startup event so at the startup so this event will come so we can put our custom initialization code here okay so like that we can put here in the post constructor so this is also this also get called at the time of initialization of the application okay so here we can put our initialization code and on basically shutdown event so here we can put our cleanup codes so besides that there is a pre destroy method also okay so here also we can write our basically cleanup codes so let's run this one so let's go here and run our application and observe the logs. So here we can see our logs. So basically post construct is called before the on start. So you can see here 
post construct so this post construct annotation is called before our on start start of event basically okay so like that so any one you can use and you can put your basically connection creating connection pool code or any startup initialization code you can put here and this is our so we clean this one we will see at the time of shutdown how it get called okay so this see this is now get so on stop basically this event shutdown event is called before the pre destroy pre destroy is called later okay so this is the sequence so you can put in you can use any method or both the method also to clean up any resource clean up if you need then you can put that code here in this method okay pre destroy or this shutdown event so this is what I wanted to show here in this video okay thank you guys thanks for watching the video bye